Welcome to our project of malware detection system. That is based on machine learning. Malware, or malicious software, poses a significant threat to our digital systems, compromising security and privacy. In our project, we focused on developing an advanced malware detection system. The system architecture including data collection, pre-processing, feature extraction, machine learning model training, and real-time scanning. To build an effective detection system, we collected a diverse dataset of malware samples from various sources. A malware detection system offers several benefits, including threat identification and classification, early detection to prevent damage and spread, protection against data breaches, optimization of system performance, real-time monitoring and response, user awareness and education, and compliance with regulations. Let's go to their interface of our application. Our interface is very user-friendly as you see it has a side widget which contains button which is clear to understand. This is the dashboard which contain the information of you system when you install our software it's automatically get the information about you system processor and RAM for scanning specific file. Folder click the custom scan button then select the directory from the computer and start scan you Scanner is for whole system scanning firstly it's analyze the whole system files and the start scanning the overall file your system contain and you will see three progress report top most is for total progress of scanning right display malware by changing its color and left one show total file scan after the scanning completion we can manage defective file as you can see a button of manage it will contain that file which are predicted as harmful file on the top you see a drop down menu which contain ignore quarantine and delete these three action you can perform on the defected file it's up to user no let's see what will happen when we apply these actions start with delete select the file then from drop down select delete no click on apply action and you see the file is gone it will delete from the application as well as from the system no check what is quarantine used for same steps as we do for delete select file and quarantine option then apply action you will see the disappear but wait you it's not deleted it's just move in a safe place where it cannot harm our computer if you remember we quarantine one file you may think where it's gone and why we need to quarantine the files so the answer is that some file are important but predicted as harmful so we move them to a safe place and when we need it we just free the file from that place no i show you the quarantine file here it is we can free this file from this location to back to the system last and the most important thing of this system is real-time protection in the top menu you see just have to on a real-time protection when real-time protection is enabled the software actively scans files programs if a threat is detected the software can automatically quarantine or remove the malicious files and notify you about the detected threat